he decided to get up and come and investigate. We're very close to a waterhole, so actually the waterhole where we were sitting at when we heard him calling the first time. But we did see, however, that there was male lion tracks going south of or south from where we are, which is the direction that we were we are traveling in currently. So that it's possible that there might actually be another guy here somewhere, or other lions at least. Um, it might be him just wanting to link up with them, or you know, we have had with the with the female lions having small cubs in the area at the moment. They actually pushed out some of the sub adults, and they had to start operating by themselves. So these boys are not going to want them too much around, because most of them are young males. So could be that they might be in for a little bit of a beating this morning if it is them we'll see but guys now you can properly see when he picks up those front feet look at the size of those paws now you can you know really see that snowshoe effect that i've been talking about so much walking in the sand it's just crazy and you can also see the three pads at the back for those of you who would like to know how we distinguish between you know cat and dog tracks always the three pads at the back very distinctive with round toes in the front for the cats dogs are a little bit more elongated but they only have the two pads at the back uh, dogs and then also the hyenas but okay so hyenas are not a cat or a dog so um they're part of the yeah <laughs> yeah guys i mean that is huge feet if if he had to put his front foot or his paw on my face he would be able to cover my face from my chin to my up to my forehead my whole face would be just one big line so okay guys he is definitely not interested in drinking water but more in finding whatever he's smelling at the moment and i'm pretty sure it's that other lion that was vocalizing as you can see there he's coming through now, but constantly looking around and sniffing the air. And there's some real intent in his eyes now. So really, really cool. Always, see, it always amazes me seeing that you know game face of a male lion. Look at that. Definitely. looking for something now just saw him marking his territory as well you know that typical spray of the urine but look at how impressive that is constantly looking around the wind is coming slightly from like his left shoulder so if he does smell something, it's going to be to our right-hand side, his left. You can see he's turned now. And it seems like he is picking up on a scent. Could be a kill. Could be other lions. We'll have to see what he uncovers. But yeah, very, very cool. I love the, you know, having the lion a little bit behind the bush now. But love having the lion... With the sun behind it, you have that outline, almost like a, you know, how every cloud has a silver lining, every lion has a gold lining. Look at that. Incredible. But he is on a mission. And it's, you know, it doesn't look like they move fast, but as soon as they start walking like that, you know, it's just a constant pace that he's covering. And they can cover some great distances just by doing so and yeah guys i mean this this male is stunning